if you like them big. And by um, I mean burgers. They got the big burgers, yeah. I've got two. Do you know what I am? I'm hungry. I'm back. How big is this gigantic Annie's burger? It's pretty big. It's pretty, it's pretty big. Yeah, when the restaurant's like, what did he just do that for? Did you break the pitch man? I'm back at Annie's, and this time, this time I'm going big. So many choices. Let me get a California burger, but no bacon. Can I sub uh, fried egg instead of bacon? Since it's actually less. Even though it's less money than bacon? Yeah, no, it's not the price. Oh, that's weird. All right. Okay. Yeah. Can, for the no bacon, can I get extra pickles? Nothing. Okay. All right, extra. Let me get extra pickles, though. No, no bacon. Oh, it's showing bacon on there. <laughs> oh, double charge the bacon. <laughs> okay, and uh, just a thick fries and a water cup, please. How does anyone decide what to eat at this place when they have so many choices of what to eat at this place? I mean, that's a lot of choices. How many choices on that thing? I know, too many of them. Thank you. I got this. So I got the number 13. Oh, lucky number. The number 13, but I got it without bacon. Bacon costs $1.50. I added an egg. They couldn't sub it. They just charged me for the egg and they just pocketed that 150 I guess. So I went with a thick fries this time and they're just, they're nothing special. They're just hot. So what I should have done is just got the classic burger and then added the avocado. If I had known I was going to get charged for the bacon, I wouldn't have done the California. I would have just worked my own magic. That There's just so many choices. I'm just, I'm overwhelmed, guys. Overwhelmed by all the choices, guys. There's just so many choices. Here at Annie's. I'm number one. Almost. Let there be burger. All right. Let there be burger. And lo and behold, the continuity. And lo and behold, there was a burger. Right here. Um, guys, it's a little, it's a little big. I resemble that remark. It's a little big. So this burger, <laughs> oh my, look, I mean, look at the enormity of it. Like this is almost as big as my head, ready? Oh, okay. Mm. Wow. Huge. Huge. Am I supposed to? Oh. <laughs> There's that beef. The thickness of that, boo. The thickness of that beef, yo. Thick beef, my friend. It went all out. Greatest burger I ever had? No, but it's gigantic. And that's what matters sometimes. Their regular fries are great. Those hook fries are hot. <laughs> no, that was too much. One day I'm gonna go viral for burning my mouth. And it will all be worth it. Decent pickle. Thick fries, nothing to back home up. Get the regular fries, not the thick fries. Sorry. 
Ini Pak. Oh, 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 oh. Lah, hai, lah. Oh, They're thick fries, while thick, but nothing special. They're big. Not as delicious as their other fries. Oh well, live and you learn. <laughs> I'll take burger though. Unlike their regular fries, their thick fries need mustard. But they're not big mustard fans here at Annie's, so they make you squeeze out. They deliver it with the... Whatever that is. So we bad. The mustard people here. Frank Barris is a mustard man, my friends. Just lick mustard off my thumb. I wasn't even my thumb. That's how crazy the mustard gets me as I forget which finger's my thumb. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. But now the fries. Burger. I just got it, really. Really. See, if I'd done the regular fries, there wouldn't be mustard in my plate, and this wouldn't have happened. So I blame the thick fries, not my own clumsiness, for how I just got mustard all over everything. And now my napkins. I mean, that's... You know what I am? I'm hungry. I smell chicken. I'm ready for an expensive burger. I, I should have. I could have saved money on it if I had used my brain, but I. The no substitution thing. What the? Really? Really, though? No. I mean, you saved the money when I took off the bacon, so why couldn't I have something of lesser value? But I digress. There we go. Now you're clean.